Hi guys, William from Executive Smash Repairs. Today, I wanted to show you guys a small issue that we can be faced with when dealing with bumper bars. This one in particular is a Volkswagen Golf R. Uh, we came across these issues with the bar and bumper bar sensors and some of the glue that's used and even we use when we apply uh, the sensors to the bar. I'll show you this area. If you come a bit closer, what this is designed to do is designed to stick to the bumper bar down here. That's supposed to stick right there. And that sensor is supposed to clip straight into here and you get a flush result. So what that's designed to do is sit perfectly against the bumper bar there and go in just like that. That'll sit there and that'll glue on. What's happened in this scenario is the glue's actually let go from this area, but it's stuck quite well to the bumper bar. Now if I show you over here, a good little example will be this area stuck on, but we can peel this up and although it looks really strong, it just comes straight off. Now if we were in a rush, or we didn't apply the right amount of time to fix this properly, this car would have gone out. In two months time, the customer would have been like, why is my bumper bar sensor not working? It would have been faced with all sorts of issues. So when we, when we do anything here, we make sure that we test it. We make sure that our guys and our technicians go over every aspect of it and even recheck it to make sure that we're gonna have the right thing. And you can only do that when you apply the right amount of time. So what we're gonna do with this, we're gonna take all the plastic off and all the glue off this bumper bar. We're gonna apply new glue um, that's supposed to work properly with it, but we'll test that again and find out what the result is. Thanks for watching, guys.